Hello and welcome to the uh, new session of our podcast, uh, SAP Mobility Development. Uh, so today, uh, let's build a gateway service with RFC tools. So it's pretty much similar with the previous session of building it with Bohr. Uh, so let's do it very quickly. So let's log on to the Sandbox uh, Gateway System. Uh, here, let's come on, use the name and password. So, still in XEAT. So, in the new versions of SAP uh, Gateway, you can use another tool called ACGW uh, Gateway Service Builder which is more convenient and much more easy uh, so here we just do for demo purpose let's do it in SE80 so here let's uh, create a new data model uh, if you have you been through with our previous session you should be very uh, familiar with it here let's see PS uh, generate from data source object okay so here uh, some descriptions simple bank service From the data source type, the remote function calls. Uh, system alias is local. Okay, click continue. Um, it's a local object. So here, let's um, click the search button and uh, find the uh, RFC calls that we want. So here, let's search for the RFC, Papi, oh it's too, sorry it's too big, it's too, too much, too much results here. Um, okay, so um, let's change it to um, so Papi uh, Bank. Uh, okay, Maybe much fewer results here. Let's see. Um, Let's see, this is the get list, Bappy Bank get list that we want. Go create the mapping here. Um, first, for the query, uh, So we would like to uh, set the bank country and bank key as the primary key, which is the SQL ID value. Okay, so here, uh, bank country, let's set in constant value, US. Okay, click OK. So here, uh, one moment, yeah. Okay, um, next one is the get detail. Can create a mapping. Can create, create, uh, read, uh, read, sorry, you read, uh, details, uh, return, uh, 
can have uh, bank keys so we have to do is to change the bank country and bank key as this is quite the uh, I'm not sure whether it has not been populated automatically um, why we should be anyway let's move on uh, also we have to flatten the um, attributes uh, and yeah some repeatable works so gateway is uh, a very good tool for us to use because we can uh, choose what we want, choose what attributes we want uh, instead of uh, returning a large bundle of data and attributes. Uh, so it could be very clean and very easy to consume in front end, such as the mobile devices. You can save a lot of um, data volumes. Um, so gateway is very important and very critical uh, in the whole um, strategy of uh, SAP mobility. So here, um, uh, first we uncheck everything and then choose the attributes that we want. So most uh, in most scenarios and in most cases, um, our users only. Um, needs several uh, attributes so uh, we can populate those attributes to them also it's quite configurable uh, so later if maybe you will add more attributes you can do a quick uh, regeneration here um, it's very easy uh, so yeah, it's yeah the okay. Um, we finish to create. Let's do a change. It's the last operation here. Let's do uh, update. Update here. Um, Okay, so we finished mapping. We we'll click generate. So here um, it's let's sit back. Wait. Okay. Um, no errors so uh, object navigation so let's um, create a consumption model let's use a uh, service name
Okay, it's a local object. <coughs> so we add data model here. Uh, so it should be sample. C sample. Okay. Okay, so we choose the um, data model. Click OK. And saved. Okay, so let's um, let's see what we have. Uh, open up the service document. Logging. Okay, sure. Uh, no errors, fine. Yeah, and uh, here we have the collection. So, also the service document. Uh, let's copy paste. So, for service name, you can also uh, change it to a friendly, uh, friendly name. Uh, anytime. So here, see the collection returns the list of the banks. Okay, cool. Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.